with us. Hey, yo, what up, everybody? It's your boy HP Maharaja, and we back at it. Today is um, February 13th, 2018. Uh, one day away from Valentine's Day, so happy Valentine's Day, early Valentine's Day for all you folks who are preparing uh, to please your partner or whatever it happens to be. Um, I'm not gonna be celebrating Valentine's Day. I mean, I think every day a girl should be feeling that she's special. Um, there's no certain day that, you know, she's only supposed to feel special, so. Especially if she's putting in the hustle and the work every day, all day, you know, you're special, you know. And it's not just the girlfriend. I think all women should be respected and all women should feel special because, yo, let me just, I think that's gonna be the topic today. Um, by the way, it's 6.35 p.m on February 13th uh, but I think today's topic is more about you know women do so much I mean you don't realize you know sure they're probably not earning as much I mean classically or generally speaking you know men have obviously been earning the most they're like the breadwinners of the family it's changing I understand but from a from a histor historical perspective that's usually been the trend but I just think about, you know, like I can work, I can code, I can do all that stuff, but I mean, but for a woman, you know, who either has given birth, that to me is like, how, like how can someone spend nine months caring and lugging around this weight on her stomach and dealing with everything outside? you know with the emotions whatever that goes through the body to the mind whatever it happens to be and then at the end of it get that you know get that baby out of the body through, through the excruciating pain it's ridiculous um, and it, and hats off to my mom you know who went through it to produce me uh, but it's something that I will never physically experience for myself to empathize with um, but I still heavily heavily empathize with it through an appreciation for what I've seen and heard and you know what I understand of it besides from that woman do so much I mean without woman you wouldn't have great cooks I mean sure male people can cook and I, I have experience in this like you know I tried cooking I can cook decent you know Gujarati food but it's just always better you know when there's a touch of that love um, from a woman's hand I mean it's it's a different game, you know. Uh, it's just because my mom's food tastes much better than my dad's food. That's just how it happens to be, you know. Uh, you can't really change that. But, uh, you know, you can't really change that. So, you know, it's crazy. It, it's, it's just, you just have to respect women. And it, it's just, it's crazy that women, you know, aren't really appreciated all the time and then when comes valentine's you know people actually start caring you know, for one day and it's it, it doesn't serve any purpose so anyways i you know that's that's one of my reflections like you know thank you guys for the woman's sisters mothers um you know girlfriends wives whatever it happens to be thank you so much for everybody in the world um for being there for hustling for doing your thing um uh, and keeping the world you know in a better a world a better place to stay so that's essentially what my valentine's message is uh, early valentine's message anyways now i want to go back to what happened in my life um i need to really make the video that sort of recaps what happened this last weekend um i went to chicago uh, attended ross mania which is a garba ross competition i was a judge there um judging the competition it was really really fun um i wouldn't compromise that experience for anything else uh, that that experience is gonna stay with me forever um, the people I met was amazing um, but more so it's just that whole ecosystem of the Ross Garba network and like trying to get deeper into those roots and trying to see how I can really help um, promote and preserve the Gujarati culture out here in America especially because I've you know started my little gig as well as an idea rossnetwork.com um, Right now, there's nothing on the website, but I'm eventually going to be building out a lot of stuff that's going to connect all the Gerba Ross enthusiasts. Um, so keep an eye out for that. Um, and that's one reason why I went. I was like, you know what? I need to experience what's going on in the real world. And 
I was, you know, I've been doing GWA for two years, and probably that experience helped me get this position to be a judge. So I'm extremely honored, and thank you so much to Ross Mania for holding all, hosting me. Um, great experience. Uh, wouldn't compromise that for anything else, as I've mentioned. Um, and yeah, so that was my weekend. I'll probably do a trailer video or something like a highlight video uh, soon. Maybe I should do it today. We'll see. Um, and then other than that, I think I'm good. I uh, went to work today, came back, ate soup plantation, it was good food, um, and we're done. The day is over. So thank you guys so much for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed it. Keep an eye out for the highlight reel. It will be coming out sometime soon, hopefully. I just got to get my hands on the computer and all the footage all in one place and organized. Uh, but other than that, thank you guys so much for watching. HP Marja signing out. Peace and love. Jai Ho. Take care.